Hello everybody. I did a soccer ball tutorial quite a while ago and when I did my tennis ball tutorial I suddenly realized that this will help me to make a perfect soccer ball, a better one than I did earlier. So I decided to make a second tutorial about how to make a soccer ball. The beginning is the same so I will not comment a lot. I will start to comment when I uh, when I explain the difference. So start with a globe uh, with a tessellation sphere control and I go to front view that's okay and center everything in the middle, hit the A key, then I select I select all the vertices, hit the B key, bevel them out till this hexagon has about sides of identical length, like so, drop the tool, then <coughs> Assign this a selection set like seams. Go to polygon mode, hit the, the D key three times, and now you see the problem. The problem is this ball is not really round. If I go to uh, reflection mode, for example, get rid of the wireframe, you can see this ball is ugly. It's not really round and we will fix that. So go to OpenGL again, hit the N key for a new polygon. Go to the sphere again, but this time a normal globe. Then Control left click and bring a globe out and I make it 110 millimeters in all the directions because this is the size of a normal soccer ball and uh, put everything in the middle here. Then I go out of uh, sub D mode and hit the D key twice. Next I go back to my original mesh, then hit the F11 key and activate constraint to background. Now I hit the R key and on the middle here I bring this out, drop the tool, deselect the outer mesh and now we have an absolutely perfect round ball. Now I can go to a lists, edge by selection set, seams. <coughs> then I make sure I am in sub D mode. You see it when you have a higher number here. Hit the B key, bevel it on the blue handle and maybe one millimeter, two is too much. Then hit Alt 3 to convert this to polygons. Hit the B key again, this time on the blue handle and bring these down. Mm, that's maybe a lot. Minus 1.5 millimeters. Hit the M key, give it the material like seams and uh, make it slightly darker, like so. Okay. Drop the tool, deselect everything, and now we have a really perfect soccer ball. I hope you like this, and uh, thanks very much for watching. Take care, and have fun modeling with Modo. See you some other time. As usual, I will leave this picture up a bit so I can use it as a thumbnail.
Thanks again and bye bye.